WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading down 14. NASDAQ is up 87. S&Ps are up 9. Gold contract trading up uh, $22.40 at 1844 an ounce. We have silver. I mean, uh, yeah, silver. We're, heck, silver's up 41 cents, $21.96 an ounce. Light sweet crude up 3 bucks, $112.41 a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10-year note up a tick, trade 119.22. The 30-year up 9 at 140.18 and King Dollar. King Dollar's down 1,077 ticks at 102.734. We just might uh, have a failure in the dollar, which uh, very well is hap it's ha happening this market. It's helping this market right now, that's for sure. The euro is at 105, the yen's at 127, and the British pound is at 124 to 1 US dollar. We get up and we take a look at the S&P. We have out here, folks, bottom line, you come down. You did reject price at uh, 387. The low, low out here was that 385. Bottom line, you know, you're going to have light volume. So we'll see what, uh, what kind of a bounce you can get going here. NDX 100, same type of setup inside the NDX. Uh, NDX right now, the, we get down to a price point of uh, 287. Now, the difference in the Qs are the Qs are going to have volume. So we'll see how the shakes out coming into the close. Uh, you know, yesterday we did uh, 70. Nine million. We're going to do more than that today. So you're going to lower price. But if you can hold price to the bottom line, you can get a little bounce going. Now, divergence we have, and this is what it is. So you get over to the Dow. The Dow broke the B point. Um, and the bottom line is that the, the B point in the Dow was this uh, 31,226. You got the 31,016. And then you're going to go back to the day that we're talking about on the break is the 12th, okay? So what you're gonna be looking at coming into the close out here is the 12th we had volume of, uh, yeah, you're not gonna break this. Yeah, the Dow's not, oh no, sorry, wrong one, one second. Any, sorry, here we go, 12th. Okay, so the 12th did, yeah, we're not gonna do it. You, you, you broke the B point, but it's not going to be with volume because we did 1.4 billion on the 12th. So bottom line, uh, we'll see whether we can get any type of bounce. The scariest part of where we are right now, folks, it would have been, to me, it would have been better if you actually did a spike low before you had something like this because we very well could be building cars at this particular point. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.